Say goodbye to Rufus. I'm gonna trade him in for a trimmed up <laughs> doggy. So right now we're gonna do an impromptu grocery haul. Cause since we've been out of town, I needed to do some shopping, so. <laughs> Morning everybody, welcome to the vlog. Welcome to the day. You guys, we traveled home yesterday and everybody was just so wasted that we just came home. We have an appointment for him to get groomed today, so say goodbye to the fluffy. Rufus, Rufus. Hi, buddy. He's like, he's like fluff, fluff, fluff. Yeah, he's gonna get a summer haircut and get groomed up and his nails clipped and stuff. It's gonna be so nice. And Maddie's gonna go cut the grass. I'm gonna get things cleaned up from our vacation and some house stuff going today. So back to life, you guys. <laughs> it was a super good trip. Loved it, it loved it, so loved fun. it. I loved it. It was so fun. We closed the park twice, which is something that we never do. It was amazing. So we were, here we, we go. were kind of at it actually last like yesterday morning because we stayed there the day before until twelve thirty. Yeah. You guys so we saw were on that. Space Mountain on twelve. Yep. Morning. We walked out and the security guard's like, have a good morning. <laughs> we're like, oh my heck. So tired. So good. It was so good. But it is good to get back to mm -hmm. life again. So say goodbye to Rufus. I'm going to trade him in for a trimmed up <laughs> doggy. I think he's beginning to know what's going on. <laughs> Well guys, one uh, drop off oh. to cut lawns and one piano tuner replacing keys in my piano later, Rufus is ready to be picked up. Hi. It's only 9.30 in the morning and we have already got so many things taken care of. It's kind of amazing. Good day. Good start it's, to a good it day. It is a way she is absolutely 100% correct. It is an excellent start to the day. I'm going to do the rest of my day though. Go get glasses checked. Oh no. Oh yeah, her glasses broke too. So <laughs> don't you worry. We will fill the day with things for sure. You guys could probably come hang out with me for a minute while I'm painting the rest of my armor and getting that. Yeah, figured she's out. doing stuff. It didn't melt while we were gone. <laughs> we reached yeah. 106 and it didn't melt. Yeah, her workshop is now the garage because I needed my kitchen table back. Mm -hmm. So she uh, hangs out in the garage now. But she's doing amazing things with her costume. But we're gonna go get Rufus now. Do you think he's buzzed? Yeah. Lion mane, like full on lion looking, or? His neck, we'll have to his see. His neck was pretty bad. I don't think you could shave his neck and make it look good. Yeah, he's going to be pretty short. So Nice summer haircut for the puppy dog because that's oh. a lot of hair and it's really hot outside. Dad's going to think he looks like a grandma dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dad's going to love it. <laughs> oh, I'm just so excited. Well, we went in really quick and grabbed him. Say hi, puppy. He's very short. He looks super cute. He'll get no love from some people in the family because he's so short, but that's oh, okay. I'm gonna love him so much. He's gonna love it. It's gonna oh feel so much better. <gasps> Hi, honey, is that so much better? Oh, you are not red anymore. He's yeah, he so light. Rufus, you look so different. So, oh my gosh, you blend in with the, <laughs> he blends in with the ground. <laughs> trying to make well, as promised, you guys, Hallie is working on her costume today she's adding some little like skull looking things skull looking things we're not quite sure what they are actually they're on astrid's costume mm -hmm. her armor but we don't know if they're like mice skulls or if they're just pendants they look like they're metal so i think the they're just, just like made them that they're way. just decoration yeah so she's in the process of making those but she's also been busy 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 working on this part of the armor. It looks so stinking cool. I love it so much. She's getting out all the tools. She's got the Dremel out and all of the paints, all got of the, the wood things. Burner, wood burner. Got an exacto knife. I have the cutting it the cutting table. I have some water in a cup in case I need to get some stuff wet. I have my I have dad's measuring tape. Uh, measuring tape. And then I have a mask. I have plastic dip spray paint. <laughs> yeah, she's just going at it, you guys. It's awesome. Bike stuff is not supposed to be here, but this is really Yeah, this really is kind of also turning cool. into a 
bike extension sit table? Yeah, it's the garage. So we're going <laughs> to... But look at these. They're so stinking cool. Love it. I'm excited to paint them. They're going to look awesome. Yeah, they are. You're awesome. So while Hallie is out um, doing her crafting, I've been outside working on a few things. Um, taking out some plants that I did not plant and some weeds that I don't want in that spot anymore. I need to put down my weed barrier, but I don't have the stakes. So I'm gonna need to go to the store to get some stakes, but I can't do that till tomorrow. And it's like a million degrees outside. So I'm pausing the work outside until tomorrow morning. And then while I was doing that, my grocery order came up. So I actually ran to the store grab my groceries and so right now we're gonna do an impromptu grocery haul because since we've been out of town I needed to do some shopping so <laughs> here's what I got at Walmart for our groceries alrighty so here's an overview of what I got um, but we'll go over it item by item um, some of you said that you like the um, hauls like this so this is what I'm going to do Okay, so we have four gallons of milk. I freeze our milk. Um, the bottom shelf in my freezer is designated for just milk. It can hold six gallons. There's two gallons in there right now, so I got four to restock the freezer. Um, we go through cereal like it's going out of style. Um, so I got two bags. I got one bag of Tutti Fruities, and we've never tried honeycomb, so I thought we'd try it, branch out a little bit. Um, box cereals are on sale somewhere else. I'm gonna get those a different time. So I didn't get, didn't get them from Walmart today. And I got some red potatoes, some russet potatoes, and some sweet potatoes. I got a bag of oranges. Oranges are not in season right now, so they're kind of green. Um, I'm hoping to use them in orange rolls or just to eat, but um, they're pretty green, so we'll have to see. And then I got a Caesar salad. Maddie wanted that, and I like this salad to have in the fridge. Um, I eat this. Nobody else really likes it, so this is just a uh, mom salad. <laughs> and then I got some crescent rolls. I use these in the morning. Um, if I want like a just a different thing to eat with eggs, we put um, Nutella in them or a strawberry jam and just make like a, a roll up type thing. Um, I got jumbo biscuits for some pull apart monkey bread that Hallie's been requesting for like, two weeks now, <laughs> so I'm gonna get that done. I got a watermelon, I'm gonna cut that up and we'll eat that. I got some avocados. They are not ripe at all, so um, as they ripen, I'll use them for avocado toast or some guacamole or just like a, a snack. We got some bananas. I got some fully cooked pork sausage patties. Um, I'm planning on making some sausage, egg and cheese, um, egg McMuffin type things. So I wanted to get the fully cooked stuff just so it's a little bit faster, a little bit easier. Um, so I got that one and then I got a bag of chicken nuggets. Yes, I have a house full of teenagers, but they still eat chicken nuggies. I've got a bag of Doritos. Those are a staple at our house all the time, along with these. These are a Alvi household traditional snack for Sundays. That's what we have. So have to have those all the time. And then I was running low on all of my cake mixes. So I got an angel food cake. Uh, Hallie loves angel food cake with strawberries and whipped cream. And then I got a strawberry cake. That made some really good cookies. I got a lemon for um, a cake or I was gonna look into making some type of muffin with those. And then a yellow and then a white because I already have a chocolate in the pantry. The kids love these so I got them. They're just kind of something I get sometimes because they're kind of expensive I think. Um, but the kids love them, so I get those once in a while. And then I got some more fully cooked sausage, brown and serve. Um, again, it's just a quick something to add to eggs or something in the morning. Um, during the summer, I don't cook breakfast every morning, but during the school year, I do. So I'm actually starting to kind of stock up on those things that I would need for the school year. And then I got some low-fat cottage cheese. That's for me. I snack on that throughout the day. Grab it, throw in some ranch mix or some garlic salt, and eat it on some Triscuit crackers. Or I can put this with some pineapple. It's really good. And then I have two packets of uh, just different types of 
instant potatoes. Again, just a quick side to go with dinner if I needed to. Um, I needed to restock the orange juice in the freezer, so I got three orange juices. And then the black forest ham and the honey smoked turkey. I needed to restock. Um, we eat sandwiches, and then it's also kind of like a bonus treat for Rufus if he's like been groomed or bathed or done something extra spectacular. He gets a piece of lunch meat and he loves it. And I got a brick of cheese because that was all gone. Hallie likes these Nor um, noodles, packets, thingies, pasta sides. Um, she likes them with nuggets. She got that from her grandma's house. <laughs> so, um, so these are a staple in my pantry as well. I got two things of SpaghettiOs, but Jack found them and already ate one. So that'll go in the pantry and he'll probably have that down tomorrow. And then I got some hamburger buns for some chicken sandwiches or um, sliders or pulled pork sandwiches. I'll probably put these in the freezer for when I need them later. And then I got two things of sausage. They're not frozen, so they're not out on the table. Um, for sausage gravy, um, things like that breakfast casseroles, things that I don't need a patty or a link for, that I need ground up. Um, I use those and then I got, I got five pounds of chicken breast. I will put those with some salt and pepper in baggies and then put them in the freezer and freeze them. And then I got five dozen eggs. Eggs right now are still really expensive, um, but we do go through a ton of eggs with French toast, scrambled eggs, boiling eggs, um, just in general, we go through a lot of eggs. So I got a five, five dozen. So this is all Walmart. It was about $180 to get all of this. Again, the milk was, the milk is high right now. Cereal is high right now. Um, eggs are high right now. Everything else was pretty close to normal, maybe up a little bit, but not too bad. Um, so yeah, this is what we got for our haul at Walmart. So these groceries are for, um, dinners, snacks, um, lunches, things like that. Um, I'm finding that if I have <laughs> more of a variety in the house, they branch out a little bit more. I got a few things that I normally don't, but then a few things that we haven't had in the house for a long time that will they'll feel like they're new, like the cinnamon French toast sticks or um, the, the chicken nuggets, because it's been a couple months since we had those in the freezer. So. That's what we got at Walmart today. I'm gonna to throw these things in the freezer and in the fridge and get some dinner going. The kids have activities tonight and Jack has football. So I'm going to feed all of them before they run off and do their individual activities. <laughs> and dad should be home from work shortly. So you guys, today is just flying by. We got a lot accomplished and Hallie's costume that she's making is looking so good. So good. She is being so diligent and having her out in the garage has actually helped a lot because she can go out there and she can just work and just do her thing and then it's not on the kitchen table. <laughs> I wish we had a cooler place for her to hang out, but um, she's making it work and it's really, really good. So I'm gonna put these things away. Rufus, inquiring minds want to know, do you like your hair cut? Do you like it? He says, oh, yes, it's so much cooler. I love it, I love it so much. Oh, really? Okay, quick. Okay, bye. Bye, girl. Have fun at your activity. Love you. Love you too. Bye. Don't fall. I don't fall. Dad and I went on a bike ride Ooh. this afternoon um, while the kids were at Young Women's and at football. You guys, those bikes are so fun. They just zip along and they're just super fun. Jack has ridden it. The girls have not ridden the bikes yet. Um, I don't know that they really want to. You want to? Oh, they want to. <laughs> but they are a little Okay. Yeah, a little, uh, a little interesting. So I don't know if we'll uh, do that or not. But also, dinner was a big hit. Everybody liked it. So the pre-cooked sausages, they just warmed. They took like five minutes to warm up and brown on either side. Um, I just fried up some eggs and toasted some English muffins. Smack them together and 
It was really, really good. Monkey bread is a hit too. Um, they got different biscuits. I ordered normal, but they gave me the butter ones as a substitute. Um, I think I like the butter ones, the butter ones better. They add a little more depth and flavor to it. So that was really, really good. So dinner was a hit. Everybody is home and getting ready for bed. We've had some late nights. We need to go to bed at a decent hour tonight. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Um, be the good, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with us today. We really super appreciate it. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Don't, do it, Maddie. Don't run away, Maddie. I'm running. Oh, you know she is we're running. Going back, back to Brazil. <laughs> Brazil? I want to go. We're going to go see some toucans. We're going back to Brazil. That bag is huge. <laughs>